Photography Club Dimabur launched its official website www.pcd.org.in at Nakhlin Coffee House in Dimabur today. Speaking at a launching program, advisor to the Chief Minister of Nagland, Abu Mehta, encouraged photographers to be an ambassador of the state. Advisor for Tafma, Teja Meru, also attended the launching of the website. The history of photography is well known to all of you. All of you are from that field. And we all know, as it is said again and again and again, that a picture, a photograph can speak a thousand words. Today, the photographers of Nagaland, young, old, wherever you may be, you may be holding an SLR camera, you may be holding a mobile phone, any sort of camera, any sort of device that can capture an image is, I think, a photographer. The advancement of technology, the availability of modern devices in our hands has made almost every citizen of the world a photographer. Today, photographers are not those ones who are moving around with an SLR camera in different corners of the world, but young people, school children, old people, grandparents, a, a guy just holding a smartphone, they're all photographers. And I think photography is going to be the new ambassador of whoever you are, wherever you are. We want photographers of Nagaland to be the new ambassadors of Nagaland. There are times when you cannot explain. There are occasions when you cannot write. And it is those times when a photograph speaks, a picture speaks. And today with the power of social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, the power of social media can reach your work to any corner of the globe. A picture taken in one corner of Nagaland can reach any continent within seconds once you post it on social media, something like Instagram. The other day I went to an exhibition of these Naga jewel, uh, jewelry and I was interacting with uh, the people who had set up stalls. There were about 16 of them. And when I was interacting with each one of them, they all did business in different platforms. There were about three or four of them who had their uh, boutiques and showrooms in Kohima and Dimapur. But interestingly, it was those ones who were selling their stuff on Instagram that did more business than the ones who had shops. So that sort of explains, even in our very simple terms, the power and reach and simplicity of how you can use social media. Today, you have information in your fingertips, a little device that you hold and tap with your fingers. Knowledge is available to everybody. There is no excuse for not knowing. Information is available at a tap of a few fingers. Therefore, you should use this information. You should use the power of social media to empower yourself, to pursue your dreams, to pursue your aspirations, and to also fulfill your career dreams. Nagaland needs positive ambassadors. For too long, we've been known for all the wrong reasons. Insurgency, violence, tribalism. We have to overcome these experiences, these challenges, and take Nagaland towards a new future. And here, young minds, young people, have to be the driving force. Social media has power. It can reach any corner of the globe, but it is also very dangerous. I want to send a message to all the people across the state, through my friends in the press and media, that we should use social media responsibly. Today, a huge percentage of information shared on various platforms are mostly fake news, wrong information, propaganda, agenda-based, divisive, polarizing. As responsible citizens, we must use social media responsibly. We mustn't try to be the first guy to forward the new information to the next WhatsApp group. We mustn't try to be the first one to share that in our family group. But rather, if we are a responsible citizen, we must first fact check it. We must ensure that the information is true. 
And even if it is true, we should not share or spread it if we feel it's going to hurt somebody. If it's going to put somebody down. So, today, you have started the website to create. You have started the club members. Can you tell us how many people are going to start the club? Photography Club Dimapur was formed in 2013 by a group of uh, friends who wanted to build a community which could bring Nagaland into world photography. And uh, today, after so many years, we are up to 40 members in strength, and we are constantly growing. At this moment, we do not have any uh, heavy criteria for new photographers to come and join the club. They just need to have the passion for photography and a simple camera with them, and they can join. Unlike others who need so many years of experience, who ask for uh, different different uh, distinctions, but uh, right now building a community is our priority, and so we urge all other photographers of uh, Dimapur, Nagaland, and other districts to come forward, join with us, and build a better Nagaland. Thank you. Our photography website. Uh, as of now is uh, very basic but uh, it has a capacity to grow into a very um, informative and uh, high-tech digital platform for uh, media creators so we are we will be holding online competitions exhibitions there will be galleries and also um, there will be member logins as well so all those people who want to join in in the future can join in through the website as well Photography as a profession actually is uh, very viable these days. We want to um, make youngsters aware of different avenues that photography can take them into. Uh, not just one sort of genre, but they can branch out into so many, which have a lot of fruitful uh, impact for the future. So as of now, our photography club, we have so many plans for the future. There, are, We want to take uh, this community to greater heights so that we can interact with not just uh, ourselves but also people from outside different states. We would uh, want them to interact with uh, resource people who are very, very experienced. They can bring their knowledge and take their game further. Also, we would like to connect with uh, different departments, tourism, as well as information and publicity, and uh, the uh, task force as well. So all of these together, we can contribute and uh, make a brighter future for all our people. Yeah. That's all for now. Keep watching Hormel TV.